Wow, that's long, buddy. How far does this go? I like it. Captain! Come here, Captain! He heard me. Yeah? What do you think? That is absolutely beautiful. I guarantee you that people go all the time, where's the water go? Right out of the rock. Oh wow, this is big. This is a good size. Nice. Wow. Wow, that's long, buddy. How far does this go? I think it's 80, 80 feet. Nice. We did this eight, nine years ago. Okay. So what would a project like this sell for? Something like this would probably be in the 40 range. That's cool how it just comes right out of that rock there, huh? I hadn't seen this project in three years. Wow. Why don't you show us how the waterfall diffuser works? Because normally there'd be mulch, it'd be hidden, so. So basically you've got this rock hiding the front of the diffuser. Look, it's size of that spider. Oh wow, that's a big spider. That's a wolf spider, huh? Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> He's like, hey, why are you picking up my waterfall rock? <laughs> so there's a the diffuser right there. Yep. Water comes out of it, and this basically just kind of hides it. Just and the nice thing about the diffuser is it allows the water to spread out and go over this rock. And of course, when it's in, you don't even see it. Right. Add a little mulch in the back there, it's gone. Right, it's gone. Yep. Four aqua blocks. So you can see the aqua blocks right here. And this is actually kind of cool because this is normally covered with gravel, but you can see how basically the water flows into the blocks, and then you would normally just have the gravel over top. You normally wouldn't see that. But so the aqua blocks start all the way back here, and then they go back to. There. Right, just so you had enough of a catch basin so that, and the point of making it this large is that when the waterfall shuts off for whatever reason, all of that water would have a place to fill up without flowing out, correct? foot long pondless waterfalls. You know, you never know what you're gonna find when you turn the corner. That's what makes it fun for me doing my job as the pond guy going out and every job is new, every job is different, every project is unique, every setting is different, but each water feature is a unique work of art, one of a kind, custom creation, but the process to build them remains the same. Hey, if you like what you see, like, comment, and subscribe. Follow along with my journeys as the pond guy, seeing beautiful, Aquascape water features. Hi, Trey. Oh, cute property. Friendly pooch. No, well, he's probably locked up. <laughs> I hope so, probably. Look at this cute little. Wow. Summer. I smell summer. So I'm in Texas, <laughs> visiting another cool pond customer, and this is your horse named Titan, huh? Titan. 
But wow. Please stop. What I need to get is uh, beautiful. Yeah, Captain needs to come up here. Captain is my horse that is very personable. Okay. Captain! Come here, Captain! He heard me. Yeah? Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh huh. The Titan's just not as personal. This guy's very so you got the horses over here and the pond over here. Over here, yes. And you are a gardener. I actually plant the uh, for the monarch butterflies. I do that. Oh, we need them because all the milkweed is disappearing. Yes, it is with all the development. So, what do you like about your pond? Oh, I love the pond. The pond is perfect. Why did you decide to get a pond? I've always wanted koi. Uh -huh. And so I always wanted a big pond. So then when the time was right, I met Trey and we did it. So all of these fish have been here since they were just four or five inches big. Yeah. And now look at them. And I have three bass minnows too. This all right here is one rock. So you and saw that and you probably said waterfalls. Exactly, and the guy that was laying, the guy that was working with me at the time, I told him, so this is a waterfall rock, and he worked for three hours trying to get the thing set in there. And I was doing other things, and finally he goes, it's not gonna work, it's not gonna happen. So- he said, so, move aside, son. You know, I said, wait till tomorrow, we'll do it tomorrow. Next thing, and the next morning we did it in 15 minutes. He spent three and a half, four hours, two minutes to sit right, because it's an odd shape up underneath. Yeah. We got it set in there, and he's going, that's awesome. Yeah, it's definitely it's, worth the extra time. And, and, and you know what, and those are the little things that working with a certified aquascape counter you'll get, because who else is going to spend that much time to get the right rock? Exactly. Ecosystem pond in it. So I'm in Texas, and you better believe I'm getting barbecue. And the nice thing about this barbecue restaurant is we did a water feature here. Love it. Pondless waterfall. The guy wanted this bridge in here to access the other side, and he wanted something for everybody to look at. Oh wow, that's big. That is absolutely beautiful. I guarantee you that people go all the time, where's the water go? Exactly. <laughs> had to end up underneath the bridge. That is brilliant. Oh, very nice. We got a big turkey down there. One thing, that little edge that goes underneath here makes everybody that stand up go, where's the water go? Because they don't see it on the other side. That's a little design tip. You don't see where the water starts or it ends, it's good. Gobble, gobble. <laughs> And with that, I'm gonna finish my day with Mr. Trey Bradley, a customer I'm very proud about. Known him for probably over 15 years. I can tell you one thing, he's a good old country boy that knows what he's doing. And for me to be able to see not only the projects that he's done, but the people's lives that he's impacted and the way that he's been able to support his family and have a cool lifestyle with cool vehicles and a beautiful piece of property. It makes it, what I do, that much more fun. So, it's not just about the waterfalls, it's not just about the ponds, not just about the barbecue, not just about living the aquascape lifestyle. It's about changing people's lives. And Trey's lives have def definitely been changed with water features, and uh, that makes my purpose on this earth that much more enjoyable. Hey, if you like what you see, like, comment, and subscribe, and maybe you too, can not only be living the aquascape lifestyles, but creating the aquascape lifestyle for other people just like Trey does. Very proud of this guy.
trip. I'm still skinny enough. Look. <laughs> okay. Oh, you know what? I gotta get a new bath.